Hey! <laughs> How is everybody? We've missed you. Oh. Lynette and Jonathan here coming oh, yeah. to you from the beautiful Fiji. island of Fiji. Oh, Check it's it so out. Beautiful. Check it out. Oh, and the air is so My clean. My falling down. Oh, we got to see the dolphins swimming this morning. It's okay, yep. babe. Putting my flowers in, getting my Fijian flower life on. That's okay, babe. So it's not going to say. Anyway, we just wanted you to get in on our happy motivation this morning. Is everybody ready? Of course, I don't know what time it is your time because we did sleep in it yesterday. Doesn't it doesn't matter. Rest day. It's always now. Oh, that's right. What's up? Always. Is it? It's now. Right so, now. is everybody ready? Let's hey, get our happy song going on. Hey, Lindsay, how are you doing? So we're zippy, 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 zappy, 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 H A P P Y. We're, we're happy. happy. Woohoo! Woo, yeah. Sing that three times. Zippy, 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 zappy, 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 H A P P Y. We're, we're happy. happy, and you are too, because every little cell in our body's healthy. Every little cell in our body's well. Every little cell in our body's happy. Every little cell in our body's well. We feel so good. We feel so well. Cause every little cell in our body's well. Every little cell in our body's happy. Every little cell in our body's well. Every little cell in our body's happy. Every little cell in our body's well. We feel so good. We feel so well. Cause every little cell in our body's well. Woo! Because all our bills are paid for, and we've got lots of money to share. Woohoo! All our bills are paid for, and we've got lots of money to share. All our bills are paid for, and we've got lots of money to share. Why? Because we feel so good. We feel so well. Because every, every little bell, bell in the body, every little bell in your body is well. What bells do you have in your body, baby? I have all baby? the bells and whistles. All that's right. All, all of them's the bells going on. I know it. I've seen them happen. It's in work. She has all the bells that's and right. the whistles. Got the bells and, and whistles going on, and you should too, because happy cells make healthy cells, right? Right. right. And the happier you are, the happier your cells are, the happier your body will be. And the more you can function in, in life. I can't even speak today. But it's okay. <laughs> it's all right. It's stage fright. It's all right, babe. It's okay. Oh, oh my gosh. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> so, anyway, we wanted to, and speaking of healthy cells and happy cells, oh, yeah. everybody familiar with the trusted, our lovely lime? Mmm. Mm, so delish. Put the lime in the that's coconut. That's right. And that's what we had the other day. Lime in the coconut. That's yep. right. We have a couple of different varieties here. We have the little... Uh, Oceanfront lime is what they called it at the market, and then we had the regular Fijian lime, which looks like an orange on the inside, but it's actually a lime, and they do taste like, mmm. So, limes are very high in vitamin C. Yes, they are. So, eat your vitamin C. They have good electrolytes in them, too. But let me tell you a little secret. Whenever you are Ooh. out and you are thirsty, you know, you, you've read in Fuel for the Body. If you have not read Fuel for the Body, definitely encourage Brilliant. you to get a copy of that up. So you can get your healthy on. But a lime, that's right, absolutely. A lime will keep you hydrated. We are so bad in dehydration because we don't want to drink enough water. Well, we encourage you to drink water, 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 purified water. Yeah, and that, I mean, we're, we are so dehydrated as a whole, like, mm -hmm. really bad. You know, and that's where a lot of the pain comes from also. You know, if you're not, if you're not hydrated, what? then you are getting inflammation, you're getting sick, you're getting dizzy. What is the number one cause for our pain in our bodies? Inflammation. Inflammation, that's right. It's and not hard. It's very simple. Just listen to these steps and do them, and it's going to help you. You're going to feel a lot better. A lot better. And here's just a little tip for our lovely lime. Not only does it have the vitamin C, the electrolytes, it has great antioxidants in it, um, it is going to hydrate your body. So if you're out and you're dehydrated, even if you're not, carry a lime around with you. Mm. Mm. Suck on a lime every couple of hours, and that will keep you from getting dehydrated, especially those of you that go on long hikes, hikes, go on biking, go on long walks. If you're out on near the equator, wherever you are, out in the sunshine, Never been take this close a lime. Oh, yeah, we're very close to the equator. Ooh. That's why we're a little bit pink. It's not yeah. from going out and being crazy and get in the ocean without any protection. We were just literally walking around yeah. and I totally forgot that we were this close to the equator so we got really red. Um, but anyway, more about that on a different video. Yeah. But we're talking about the lime. Limes will hydrate you, will keep you from getting thirsty. And also another tidbit is you don't want to carry ice water around because quite the contrary, you may think that it quen quenches your thirst right off the bat because you want thirstier. that cold, cold, cold drink to satisfy those, those glands in there. 
but it actually makes you more thirsty. Yep. And it makes you more dehydrated because you just can't get enough. Whenever you bring, brink, what is wrong with me? Okay. <laughs> I've been brinking on it's the bra okay. again. <laughs> Whenever you drink uh, warm water or body temperature water, it actually goes through your cells better and it keeps you more hydrated. I learned this trick in Guyana when I was over there. And then, of course, I did a lot of studying after I got back about drinking room temperature and hot waters. Because what happens at the dinner table? Whenever you hear a lot of people having heart attacks, have you heard that, babe? Oh, at the dinner too table. Too many, a lot at the dinner table. Yeah. Well, one of those reasons why is because number one, they're eating a lot of toxic food out there. They're eating a lot of high-fat food, probably. Well, what happens whenever you put melted coconut oil or melted butter or anything that is an oil? Whenever you put that in ice cold water, what happens? It melts. No, when you put the melted in ice cold water. It solidifies. It gets hard. Right. Yeah. Whenever you put a liquid into, well, not all liquids, like I said, butter, coconut oil, or uh, different fatty oils, when you put it in an ice cold drink, it solidifies. So what happens whenever it goes through your cells and you have, you just had this big dinner of all of these butters or oils or whatever it was, fatty foods, and you immediately chase it down with an ice cold drink, it hardens everything and it just causes everything to instantly congest and that's what causes the instant heart attacks because everything is clogging up in their arteries not necessarily clogging up it's just getting solidified with all those oils that they just ate so therefore it's causing a combustion therefore is your heart attack at the dinner tables so it's very important to drink room temperature body temperature or hot drinks whether it be teas or water or different things like that just please refrain from sodas as much as you can because those are very detrimental but uh, to keep yourself hydrated drink water 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 and eat the trusted lime because it is so full of electrolytes vitamin C and antioxidants very good for you and it does quench your thirst it really really works everybody all of my teammates could not believe how I was not getting so dehydrated and so thirsty and we were right on the equator in Guyana it was like drenching pouring sweat hot I actually loved it and what, when in Rome, what happens? Do as the Romans. Do as the Romans. <laughs> Do not change their culture. They know. Don't they live on the dare. land. And they were There's living off the land. Or? That's right. They were mm -hmm. telling me what to do. And it was working. And so I was very hydrated. So I learned that lesson a long time ago in Guyana. So eat the trusted lime. And mothers, it is very safe to give to your children. Drink, put lime in the water. Even have them to suck on a lime. It's not going to harm them. Of course, it... You know, you won't want to have them sucking on lime all day long because they are they have a bad habit of putting it right on their teeth, so it is going to uh, soften that enamel. So you want to be careful with that. Just have them to put a lime in their mouth and suck on it inside their mouth. So have your lime and enjoy it and put your lime everywhere. It's good for all kinds of cooking. So that is our tip for today, the lovely lime. Yep. So from us to you, have the most amazing, vibrant, and abundant day ever because you are awesome. You're beautiful. You're amazing. And you are, are love. Mm. From, From us, us to you, you have, have the most, most amazing, amazing day, day ever, ever and be blessed. Mm. Bye. Bye-bye.